So this is the kitchen. Um, we have some white, the white cabinet and the vent, the cabinet down, and we have the kitchen cooking top. Guys, this is actually stove, and uh, we have this one's here. The floor in the kitchen is wood. I know the white counters are high maintenance. Well, according to the builders, they said when it gets dirty, you can just wipe and it's going to come off easily. And we have the large, and that's my tripod bag. We have the large counter. That's how we stand in there. Well, we'll see you in the next place. Welcome guys to Nelly's White Lions channel, wife, mom to the cuties, a career girl, an entrepreneur. My name is Nelly, aka Nelly White Lion because I am married to the White Lion himself. Hi everyone, this is Nelly White Lion's channel. Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time of seeing this lady, this Brego lady, welcome to my channel. And if you have subscribed, Please do not forget to hit the notification bell. Today is a beautiful day. It's a really bright day and I'm here at the new house. Like I said, I was going to do an empty house tour today. We built um, our home here in the United States. Um, it was finished May 10, 2021. So I have decided to do an empty house tour before we start putting the furniture. As of this time, we've not moved. We're still in our old house. Um, and we're trying to see, we are trying to move our things over. So I have decided to come to do an empty house um, tour. Anybody yes, coming. Here? Yeah. So this is the new house. Once you get through the door, and this is outside. People are still, they're still building houses outside. When you get into the house, you see the walkway. And um, I think I believe we're going to put the console um, uh, cables here. And this house was built by Capstone. They still have their stuff where we've not moved in here because we still think of moving in. And when you come along here, you're going to see the. Um, this, they say this is a formal dining, but I believe um, my hobby is going to convert this to an office. This is a formal dining. I mean, this is a dining, we have another dining in there, but they said this is a dining. So, hobby is going to convert this place to an office, which I believe is more realistic because when people get in here, you don't want them to go inside. You just want them to do their business here before going. Then come along with me. You get in here. This is like a closet. No, my that's my jacket. I keep my jacket here. So this is like a closet when you know when you have visitors, you we just keep your yeah, jacket here. And um, sorry about that. Then this brings you out to the main floor. You have the kitchen. You have the what's it called again? Counter top stove. And we have the. This is good, I'm in my mind. Pregnancy, pregnancy, pregnancy. This is the vents. I mean, I love this. This was one of my requirements when we were building the house, the stove, and these are my cabinets. Over here, you have the range, the microwave, and the oven. And down here, I believe uh, this is, I don't know, maybe this is the breakfast, lunch, or whatever. It is, and we still have cabinet here. And this is my bag. And here is the pantry. Um, I mean, the pantry is sizable. It's a sizable pantry. I was telling Harvey I'm going to change this and put wood, but he was like, leave it like this for the moment. You know, when we move in, we can change. But yeah, I love the pantry because it's sizable. One of the requirements also I was looking for in the house. Do not forget to say this area is the formal uh, dining. So we're going to go back to the kitchen. So you can walk through this area towards the kitchen. We have the uh, you know our sink and uh, the cabinets, dishwasher. 
I believe this is where we put the trash. You put the trash in here. And maybe the other counters you put your other stuff. And this is center um, item. This is huge. That's my Amazon stuff. Just forget about all those YouTube accessories. So this is the um, big center island. This is huge. And come to all this I wonder what I'm gonna do with all this uh, This is the window. I really love the, the, the way we do the dishes to have, you know, like window. And over this side, we have the fridge. This is the fridge I, I asked for. I told the builders to put this fridge. The reason why, because this fridge does not have the, you know, the outside, um, where you get the water from the outside because my kids, especially my little daughter, she's very inquisitive. So I, I requested for this kind of um, fridge, double side fridge. So in here, we're gonna get the water from in here. At least she'll be scared to open the fridge to get water. So this is where the water is gonna come from. That was what I asked for, you know. You can see it's all brand new, we've not really opened it, and it comes with a filter which we're gonna put. And then below is the Below is the freezer and uh, over here is the, ice, is the ice maker. Over there is ice maker. I don't want it to be outside because of Sophie, you know, but this is what I asked for. Though I'm gonna get another fridge, I'm gonna get another fridge, but yeah. This is the kind of fridge I wanted. I wanted something simple. But, but I believe this is another dining. So that was why I told Hobby to convert all the one to, you know, the office. And because this is another dining, we're going to keep the dining table too. You know, outside, we're going to put a deck. When you build a new house, it doesn't come with a deck. So, for now, this place is locked. And what is us? I said, you know. So we're going to put a deck there, we can open it. Most people in the United States, you know, so that they know when you have a new house, you don't come with a deck. That's extra money, $5,000 more. Light, sorry. This light, probably doesn't like this light. He said he's going to change it. He said he's going to change it and I support him because when we try to change the lights, you know, there's no working, there's no backsplash. When we try, when I try to choose, there's no backsplash here. When I try to choose the backsplash, they ask us to pay extra $12,000 $12, and I told Hobby, you know what, let them finish their work. We're gonna put the backsplash. So, I'll be already going to Home Depot to check the price of the backsplash. So, we're gonna fix that ourselves. You know, when you're building a house, the more you add accessories, the more the cost of the house will go. And this brings us to the living room. The living room, or what? Then, so we have this. I love this sun light here. This thing is not on the house. How do you just see? My husband is a fancy guy. He just put this light in and he said he's gonna put it around the house. And we have the gas fireplace. We have the fireplace. This is really beautiful. Well, he's trying to turn it on. I don't know how to turn it on. Yeah, look at that. That's so beautiful. And those wood are not real, right? At this time, when he said we're gonna put the TV, I kind of I said no. When I looked at the house, I said. I wanted to put like a very fancy antique mirror here for the same no but I'm gonna use the I was I was thinking of using like curtains. Mama did my cousin said no he wants lines. So we're gonna go with lines, you know, two two up I agree to this idea. And downstairs. Uh, so this is the bathroom. That, this thing they said this is Korean. I don't know if you that that can. And I asked why didn't they put like uh, they go with grinder. They said this is called Korean and it's better than grinder because um, they said when the ladies we, when we use the heat is it heat recorders? No, when we use the uh, air, hair whatever to straighten your hair, when you put it here and if you get burned, you can just file it and it will just get back to normal. Or when there's a stain, so I don't know if you guys are the tents. I don't know. And over, over here is the garage door. See, this is the garage. This is the garage. Uh, this is the garage. So when you come from the garage, um, you got the, the, the bathroom, they call it, where you keep your jacket and everything. 
and I'm just gonna you keep it together and everything. Obviously, I'm just gonna keep a like a bench here, you know, so people can sit and wear their shoes. So this brings us to the room downstairs. I'm going to use this for an office and I said no way, there's no way people. I'm gonna pass through my um, living room to come here and to decide to leave this like this and use the former um, dining for all this. The coach down here. So from there, do not forget this is the living room. This is the do not forget this is the living room and that is the dining over there, the kitchen, you're gonna put like some stuff over there. This way. So this way brings us going upstairs. So this brings you to another living room. And you're gonna use this uh, kids' corner. And this takes you to the master's bedroom. Not that very big, but I mean it's sizable enough with a vaulted ceiling with this bad window. You know? And the light up here, I think we're gonna leave the slides. We're gonna leave the slides like this. I don't know if my people decide to change the lighting, but we're gonna leave the light like that. And this takes you to the owner's suit. Takes us to the owner's suit bathroom. Like this window here, they didn't want to put this window. I told them, no, I need this natural. Um, Metro lighting now is the back top here, and we have this double side sink. At least here he's gonna be there washing his mouth. I'm here washing my own mouth. There's no reason to say, Nelly, hurry up, hurry up. <laughs> you can say that. Hey, what are you doing there? And this is the shower over here. It's walkable. This is going. It's walkable. You go in. The shower over there, and those are the accessories in there, minimal. So, I mean, this is big enough. It's big enough, and I love it because it's to the ceiling. We'll come over here, the toilet is here. We have the toilet. I love this because it's, there's a privacy here. I mean, somebody's gonna be doing the doo doo there. <laughs> so, you open this, and that's the toilet. You know, privacy toilet, yeah, by itself. And I got this, not really big, but this is the walk-in closet. So you start from here, you go this way, you go this way. I don't think the camera is doing justice to me. And you go this way, the closet belongs to one of us. So I wanted to change this. I wanted like a former, you know, mood. But Oga, he was like, leave this first. You want to do anything to your own side. I mean, he was already sharing the place. <laughs> he said, you're going to take this side, I'm going to take this. But yeah, this is massive bro. For me, like, if you add it up, this is almost like a room. A room. I'm so much in love with the closet. Like, it's big. Like, maybe my will take this side. Because, you know, guys, they don't have much. Not my husband. My husband <laughs> loves clothing. You know, but anyway, this is this is the working closet. Yeah, this is the working closet. We're gonna do some justice to it. So, going to back here to the kids' corner, the living room, and from there we go into the first room here. This I believe is gonna be the kids, one of the kids' rooms. It's sizable with a mirror or uh, with a whatever. And the walking closet, you can. I mean, this, I love this, it's big enough. The walking closet for the kids. Yeah. We want to be close to the kids. Then this thing up here to a bathroom I actually request for is called a Jack and Jill. I love Jack and Jill bathroom because it has like privacy. So the kid in this will be using this um, sink. To be doing their activities, whatever they're doing. Another child will be in the bathroom. So that kid, that room is using this bathroom. Okay. There's another sink there. And there's 
the toilet here as well. So when another, when a child is in that sink, using that sink, somebody can be bathing here. Why another child, you know, can also be using here? And that brings us to another another type um, to another type of room. This is another room here too. So it's like this room and the other room. This room and the other room has um, has a bathroom in between them, and it's called um, Jack and Jill because it has like double sink, and it has the uh, toilet, it has the um, um, tub, meaning one and with a door, like a privacy door in between, so one child can be in there. Meaning, I mean, when they grow up, can be washing their mouth, like using the sink, privacy, doing their hair stuff, doing their mustache, dyeing their hair, while another child will be over there. And this other room also have a walk-in closet. This is a walk-in closet too. It's side room. It's another walk-in closet for the kids. Yeah. And this brings you back to the little passage where we have um, where we're going to be keeping our cut, um, towels and the rest of the stuff. And over here is another bathroom. Over here is another bathroom. So, yeah. And a shower. No, not a shower. There's a bathroom and a tub. This is, um, the house is like four full bath, right? So this is a tub and, uh, you know, this is the sink. I believe another room is going to be using, uh, another room is going to be using this. So this takes you out again to another room here. <laughs> so I believe this, but the person in this room is gonna use the other um, bathroom. And this also have. Oh, this one is big. Look, look at that. It's big. Like this stuff, I go, this this stuff I'm gonna go out. Maybe the next time I do a house tour, we might have settled in the house. Then we we'll see what we do. Yeah. So yeah, this takes us back. So the kids corner again and here we're gonna have uh, the laundry room I love this house because the laundry room is upstairs the majority of the houses the laundry rooms you know are down this gives you quite convenient like you come out so we're gonna put the laundry and this house did not come this house did not come with uh, the washer and uh, dryer I believe so that was why the other day we went to go to for what we'll be needing. We're going down. We're gonna go down to the basement. So this brings us back to the first floor. We just came up from the top. So up. This brings us to the first level. And um, back to the passage. This door goes to the basement. The basement is unfinished. But um Bob is already making preparation so Finish the basement. So this thing has a party big room. <laughs> no, don't get me wrong. No. So this place is not a party room anyway. So this is the basement. This is the basement. You see how big this is. By the time we finish the basement, this place from this door is going to get more two rooms from here. Yeah, right? Two more rooms and over here is our furnace. Um, my family back home. My family back home. Our furnace means where the heating, everything generates from. So this is the furnace um, area. The builder told us this place is another bathroom. We can create another bathroom from here. Okay, the bath. You can maybe create the shower. Oh, sorry. This is my bedroom. Oh, this should be the bath here. And this is the toilet. That's what the builder said. So this down will serve the two rooms down there. And um, this is the side of the storage room. You know, Break over your storage. And this is the water heater. One water heater. And change all this. I don't know this thing. So that's going to be uh, whatever. So this is our storage over here. And this all these are all brand new. And that is why I love it. So the storage, obviously, call some people, they're gonna just finish up here, we're gonna put 
Sorry, so yeah. This is our lovely, 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 lovely bowl. For now, I don't want to go down. You know, uh, he wanted to like start making the two rooms. Oh, who? Who is he making the two rooms for? I don't know. So we're going back upstairs. So we're back on the main floor and this quickly to the end of the empty house store. I don't know if I did good, but I believe probably would have done better than me because I don't I'm not so familiar with this building tanks, but anyway, what we have here right now is a five bedroom, four bath with the possibility of having two extra bedrooms downstairs and a bathroom and a living and a living and a and the living room downstairs making a total of seven rooms and five baths and three living rooms. Well, leave me a comment if I hit this or not. You want to ask me questions, I'll be willing to share. You want to give me tips on how to decorate the house, I'll be very, very happy to work on any idea from you guys. I believe the next time I'm going to do a um, house store, we'll have put furniture in here. I'll do the minimum I can. But anyway, thank you very much. If it's your first time of seeing this beautiful face, smiling face, very good lady, please do not forget to hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell. Mwah. Love you all. Bye. And this is the house. Is it? They're going to put the grass maybe next month. And this is the um, drive way and this is a sidewalk it's already done obviously trying to check the mailbox the place is looking somehow right now but don't worry maybe in the next one or two months when we move in everything is gonna be there are new construction over here yeah and these are the houses that were just built I think these houses were built like maybe February this house is over here yeah, I'll see you guys inside or outside, whichever comes first.